See this plant over here? It's called South Brush. Come, gather its berries in your pouch. Aloy, come now. Gather the berries. Good. Now eat the berries. They may taste bitter, but they can save your life. Always keep your pouch full of medicinal berries, flowers, and plants. Where are we? This valley is just a part of all mother's embrace. Embrace? The Nora tribe watches these lands and keeps out the most dangerous machines, usually. Yummy! Okay, welcome back to Surviving the Dawn. This is Season Further 1, Episode river, 2. We'll find a herd of machines, and I will teach you how to hunt. Are they dangerous? All machines are dangerous, Aloy. Their power must be respected. But I will be beside you. Okay, at this moment we are following Russ to a particular area. And we might be doing some hunting. Okay. Aloy, a machine's coming. Crouch and follow me into the tall grass. Looks like our focus is being used effectively in this one. I hope nothing's buffering at the moment because there. I'm having a bit of an now issue with that. No, Aloy. Such machines are called watchers. You must learn to avoid their gaze. If you are to survive in the wilds, I will show you. Listen close and do as I do. Stay still. Wait for it to pass. Now keep okay. Low and follow me across the trail to that tall grass. Right. Currently, I cannot see a single thing that's happening. This is what happens when you use oh, a device that has, doesn't have enough RAM. But I can imagine that Rust at the moment is showing Aloy how to do his, do her thing try and keep away from the the machines come back this way the slower you move the quieter you'll be and crouched walking is quieter than upright okay that's good to know so whenever we crouch we make Wait less noise it also looks like it also looks like um, we shield ourselves from their line of sight when we are in this red grass area, or you know, thicker grass. That's the last of them. Let's move on. All I have to do is follow Rust in this one. You did well. They didn't see or hear you. Now stay close. That herd should be just ahead. And what you're seeing at the moment is what we'll probably be doing most of the time. It's interesting how the Nora have made a bit of a pathway. Well, who are these guys? Who's that? Ignore him. But why is he up there? Hmm quite agile he's smiling at us Deb, get back where you belong Deb, where are you ignore him we are outcasts and he is of the tribe maybe he doesn't like the tribe then he is a fool come now let's find that herd follow okay it seems that the other group is known as the tribe probably the nora tribe so we are known as the outcasts and look like looks like we are frowned upon i wonder why what has ross done what has aloy done there i mean even when them? she was born these are called striders striders ha get Why'd you chase them all? 
to show you how some machines startle easily if they detect you and run away. Mm. They're best approached by stealth. Don't worry. We'll catch up with them further down the valley. You'll see. Yeah, the only problem is I can imagine some of them won't run away. They'll probably attack now, you. Now, I want you to find some rocks that fit the cup of your hand. Why? Do as I say, Aloy, and gather the rocks. I will show you how to use them. Good. That's it. Those will do. Follow. Hmm. Okay, so we just picked up some stones. Maybe Russ will show us the ancient Nora art of stone throwing. <laughs> yeah, you better hurry up. Okay, so at this moment it's quite interesting recording There's stuff. Okay. All right, it's time to throw some rocks. But rocks can't hurt machines, right? No, but they can distract them, draw them into traps. Like that watcher over there. It must be dealt with, or it will warn the herd and send them running before we get in range. Warn them? How? The machines speak to each other, Aloy, unless they are first silenced. Now you stay here on the ridge. On my signal, throw rocks and draw the watcher over to me. Wait for my signal. Okay. So we're glorified stone throwers for Rust to show show off. Interesting. Aloy, throw a rock near me. Okay, and then Rust in for the kill. Come, girl, it's safe now. Hmm. Not bad. Oh! No Harvest injuries going on so over there. Teach you how to make arrows. Harvest the kill, anyway. Pay attention. Okay, so whenever we... We... Make a kill... A robot now, kill, then we must make sure. Stocks of Ridgewood from the plants over there. Then we must make sure that we harvest it because that'll that'll be used for weaponry, armors, and all of that. So that's very important. Well, that's what I'm guessing anyway. Use the stocks as arrow shafts and metal shards for our heads. Oh, what a sunset! Okay, so we're going to make some arrowheads now, and it looks like we make quite a few at a time. Looks like ten at a time. Good. You'll never run out of arrows if you know how to craft what you need. Let's put those arrows to use. Hmm. Fun. Okay. So what are we hunting? Looks like we've crouched down a bit. Here, stay low in the grass and be quiet. It's time to make your first kill, Aloy. Strider, one of the weaker machines. But even a weak machine can kill a hunter if she's careless. You must study her. Its hide is thick, but there are spots where it is vulnerable, like its eye. Can you guess another? It looks like we have to hit that yellow thing it's on its backside. On its back. Is that a weakness? Yes. How did you guess that? The device. It showed me. But that plaything? Well, stop playing games. Now, take down that strider. Target the eye or the canister. And if it charges, be ready to roll out of the way. Okay, that trinket seems to help quite a lot, so that's good. 
So we just need to aim and fire. Again. Oh, good. Well done, Aloy. Pat's on the back. Now, what do I do with this, with this arrow that I'm ready to hit? I have to throw it down somewhere. Yeah. Don't think I can pick it up. Yeah. Oh well. Going for the kill. Metal shards you on well my. today, but you have much to learn. Tomorrow, we train again. What was that? That boy. Uh -oh. The one running the brave trails. Follow Eloy. Quick. Oh, nothing but trouble. Okay, let's go. Maybe we can help. Nothing like running through a valley to to help another person in need, even if they're part of the Nora tribe. That's quite interesting how how outcasts are deemed as outcasts. It must be there must be some kind of reason for it, but we'll probably learn that later. Okay, so I like I like the part where we where we're going through the um, the different actions that we can do. Oh. Cutscene. Oh, what an idiot! Uh oh. Trinkets of good use. Sneak through. You will not. Ah, oh, Rust. Fulfilling your duties with efficiency. You got one job. Okay. Looks like we're gonna have to save this this gentleman. Okay, so we're gonna have to use this this trinket to figure out where to go. So let's see. Obviously, we can't really shoot them. Let me see now. That guy is looking for something. Okay. Oh, okay. So we see that there is parkway. So we must. Basically, we must veer off the pathway. Okay. I think we can tag the target so then we don't have to... There we go. Okay. So now we just need to look around. Okay. So he makes a bit of a circle over there. See, if we keep out of out of his way then need to do this should be fine quiet. can't let them see me yeah huh. first task so now we need to be careful I didn't last long over there. <laughs> okay, just getting used to how, how I need to stay out. I mean, I'm sure if I had a weapon, it would be a different story altogether. Okay, let's try again. So obviously that way is not going to work. Okay. 
obviously it's the watches that I have to watch out for. Pun intended. I need to see their path. Like I said, it's the watches that I have to watch out for. So those guys aren't the problem. It's those ones that walk around. They're obviously the protector. You see, I'm already so close to that other one over there. So where is this guy? Okay, you see he's over there. Okay, now we just need to figure out. The other guy sounds very close. Gotta watch out for him. Oh, so close. See, you heard something. Okay, we just need to watch out. Okay, he's walking back. That way it should be open and then we can go through. Man, this feels intense. And there we go. I can't let them see me. Okay, but what about the others? Nope. Everything seems to be in the clear. And there we go. Quite intense for our first try. Hopefully we don't have to try and get out. Oh, you're you're kidding me. Okay. Oh, so close to that one. Might need to be careful. Okay, not too bad. Okay. How are you doing this? Good time to do that. Or maybe it is. Hey, we made it past. Okay. There we go. All right. Rust, we made it. No. Where's that idiot going? That item could be quite useful in future. Wait. Oh, Mother, bless that girl. Bless you both. She, Oi! She 
rescued me. Look, I just want to... Boy! Seal your lips! They are outcasts, both. And she... is motherless. Oh, so she's a special kind of outcast. Come now! Back motherless. So Mother Heart must be a special place. That's not really cool. That boy should not have spoken to us. It's against tribal law. We'll go home now. Follow. I know the way. Really? Stay away, no mother. Really? Ooh, we get to choose at least something. I wonder if that actually affects the the decisions that we make in later parts of the game. Okay, so these are our flashpoints, so we can either choose might, looks like mind and heart. Hmm. Should I drop the rock? Aim for his head or knock the rock from his hands. Oop, drop the rock. Anger management much. You're bleeding. Let me have a look. Here, hold still. I'll get it. Why? Shh. Why am I an outcast? Aloy, this is not the time. Who was my mother? Aloy, I've told you before, that's not for us to know. You were just a newborn when the matriarchs brought you to me. So the matriarchs, they know? <sighs> it's not so simple. But they know. Aloy, we are outcasts. So how do I make them tell me? The matriarchs? There is a way, perhaps. So tell me. It would be dangerous. How? It would take years of training. I don't care. How do I do it? Tell me! The proving. The tribe's rite of passage held every year. Those who pass become braves. But to the one who wins, the matriarchs grant a boon. A boon? Yes, whatever the winner wants. Then I'll do it. <laughs> whatever it takes. I'll win the proving. I see. We'd best get started then. Mm -hmm. Your training will be hard. And it'll take years. Start training? Yes. Follow. Mr. Piccolo. Okay. Training montage. Okay, so it looks like Aloy is going to go through the whole training bit now. That should be interesting. Good save. Hmm. Looks like she's getting used to that focus thing. I guess that's what we can call it. Uh, the bonds of surrogate dad and daughter.
Ah, there we go, lady. Looks like that mon montage of training is actually working out for her. Climbing up mountains, taking out watches, and everything else. Oh, she's quite versatile. Well done. And that is the end of our second episode. Tune in for episode three to see how this journey continues. Thank you very much and enjoy evening.